Hello everyone. Welcome to Federal Join Sex Nest Talk. We are a community engagement ninjas who help newcomers feel right at home in the community and we are slowly getting started with contributing to the community as well. I'm Akash Deepthar and I'm accompanied with Alberto, Andrea Hi. and Vipul. Hi. Let's get started with the presentation. So let's talk about what we plan to accomplish with the joint seg and the things that we wish to make happen. Starting with engaging in active communication among contributors, both prospective and existing ones, then giving self-contained and well-documented issues to the new contributors for them to get a feeling of things that they're getting into. Then we lead and assist the prospective contributors to a point that they turn into successful ones down the line. After that, we build a better mentor mentee connection among existing and prospective contributors. Finally, we move uh, and provide a comfy communication channel that folks would want to use in order to dive into our world. Now let us discuss more about how newcomers can feel right at home with us. One of the very first thing that new contributors would like to do is uh, they would feel like picking up an issue ticket or, you know, to start working to get traction. All of this can be very functional in terms of uh, approach in theory. It is one of the things that connects the contributors to the work instead of to the community. And we see them as not a friend, but a person who wants to get stuff done. So a newcomer would really want to first get to know the folks around them in the community, then talk about relevant latest and upcoming stuff, and then explore the teams and sub projects that they would want to contribute to. We like to believe that for newcomers, discovering about new things should happen organically in a way that they would be able to figure out what is it that they would really like to contribute to. Moving on. Then uh, the newcomers are appreciated to go deeper into the things that they have singled out and picked that they would uh, want to be a part of it. Be it about designing uh, shiny looking badges, packaging stuff into RPMs, making documentation, writing code or translating software. Everything could use some reading up and knowing about. So a newcomer would really want to first uh, a look around the documentation and applications and channels. There are always folks around you who definitely know more about a certain thing and they can be a source of information for you. Secondly, take the project that uh, uh, they're interested for, for a spin to have a first-hand experience. And thirdly, to inform related teams and sub-projects if they come across any kinds of bugs or discrepancies or uh, mistakes. Uh, we like to believe that for newcomers uh, should not be assigned any issue tickets to start with. That is not what we do unless, well, they ask for the assignments of the tickets and that's entirely a different case. Finally, when newcomers become friends with the community and uh, they know about the projects that they're interested in and they are literally into what they're doing in the community, it is now time with the exciting stuff that is to start with contribution uh, they literally get to decide the way they want to contribute the team that they wish to be a part of and any extent of uh, time and effort that they want to devote to the community they get to choose so at this point in time when a newcomer is not a newcomer but uh, a celebrated member of the community they can get started with any of uh, making pull requests or for adding new features or fixing old issues or embracing their imagination by coming up with great designs or writing about or translating things that people should know about. Now for newcomers that they can call themselves a friend of Fedora and we really appreciate the time and effort that they put in into participating with the community uh it's really the only way is up i will now pass it over to alberto who will delve into explaining how good we have been 
in our initiative so far over to you alberto how successful has our initiative been so far well uh, we've done a lot of classrooms uh, with a very great quality um, mostly all the uh, in video classrooms are in youtube in the youtube channel of fedora so i will put the link soon in the chat uh, we have a complete section for the classrooms and yeah uh, the most recent as was the rpm packaging so uh, it's a great classroom uh, thanks anchor for that and um, well we had a lot of material to share with uh, newcomers so uh, uh, new contributors benefit from these uh, videos, from the documentation. Also, we have a lot of moderation and solve questions on on Ask Fedora. is a great a great part a great part of no work in in the Fedora in the Fedora Join Seek. So uh, we can we can do a lot of of things here for newcomers, for users, for con new contributors. So having these uh, parts of the Fedora John Seek are very important. Um, thanks, Luna. Yes, this, uh, these videos. Okay, next slide, please. Okay, in us Fedora, we have uh, a lot of, of words. Uh, uh, you know, uh, the last year we had uh, 1, 1, 5 thousand discussion posted, new posted. Um, mostly we solved it um, uh, 500, maybe. It, um, most of the of this work was done for no heroes. Um, he's the lead. People can take uh, the forum like own and make it a great place to search qu uh, for questions, for for solving problems, to contact the community is a, a great place. Uh, was a titanic word from from Anchor and other moderators to maintain Ax Fedora like a place with a uh, great quality material no it's it's a great word um next uh, slide please so uh, who is this in in numbers uh the new form to get the uh, newcomers bueno well um uh, to treat newcomers new contributors is open um ticket mostly yes uh, i don't see the slides everyone okay yes, there is um we open mostly 63 new tickets no uh our current rate of success more or less are a uh, i think at 28 uh, percent done new contributors graduate um i we had some cold tickets, you know, who passed some time from the uh, the when up when we opened the ticket to now, uh, we got some relative advance of of this. There are thirty four, mostly the fifty percent of the of the tickets are in in this part. Uh, and well, we had uh, some quit people can say hey well this is not for me but thanks no this is uh, I need to experiment this and know who is this and say oh, well this is not for me are more or less the seven percent of the tickets maybe we can say hey it's not so good numbers but really they are uh, if you Think a little uh, a bit about for this, you know. Bueno, we can ima imagine um, 
in a talk with a hundred people, if you ask, oh, we who we and who who went um, free open source high quality operating system? Well, of course we are talking about Fedora. Um, and they say mostly everyone we raise the hand and say, oh, I I want that. No, this will be great. And if you ask, well, okay, uh, how many wants to open a Bootsilla ticket? Mostly 10, mostly seven will raise the hand of 100 was, okay, seven, 10%, 10% of the people went side. If you ask, okay, we want to submit the patch or or open the or, or package the the software you want or or translate the the documentation you wanted you in your mother language you say okay maybe one of the 100 do you think mostly in this uh, contributors or fellow contributors are uh, people that um, have the value of the no oh, have the value are more valuable people you no know, are very rare are very very difficult to to get and these numbers are great for for these things no we we now know it's not uh it's not easy get people to contribute yeah, uh, in the project or in every free and open source project is very difficult and we want to make make it this easy. So thinking about it, this is a great numbers for the SIG. I think we can do better. I don't know who and uh, now, but we are working and we are research who can do this better, no? So thanks for hearing me. I I I say the the words for Andy. Andy, you are prepared. Yes, I'm prepared. Uh, so thanks, Alberto. Um, yeah, how do we plan um, on incentivizing participation? Um, so um. Next slide, yeah. So um, we're shiny, sparkling recognition. How do we plan this? So become a part. So help newcomers and become a valuable part of the community. And this is, um, these are um, badges we uh, have um, des uh, designed and uh, they're um, coming soon. So, <laughs> um, and so the ideas, um, and there, are, uh, for example, the first bet, uh, yeah, hi, awarded once a person becomes a proud member of join. Oh, sick. Um, th those of you who may be um, familiar with, with the badge system um, know that um, getting a badge um, or receive badges for um, participation, volunteering in several stuff, stuff in Fedora, let me say QA testing or translation, wiki, or um, kernel testing is also a good place to start and help, um, by the way. Um, uh, is in my opinion always a good feedback of Fedora and to motivate uh, new newbies to um, to stay and work on Fedora. This is a kind of, in my opinion, um, giving feedback and appreciating the volunteer work. Um, the other badge is create a better onboarding experience to the ecosystem. Awarded once a person closes a welcome ticket as complete. Um, yeah, a quantified badge which can be earned with more involvement. So, uh, well, uh, is it so that uh, this, uh, uh, if you actually, 
I will say this later, but okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, um, any, uh, anyhow, uh, therefore, I, th this, uh, this badge will be awarded if you, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, um, uh, award, uh, close the welcome ticket as complete and so and all is fine. Um, then next slide, please. <clears throat> so uh, ideas and specialist. Uh, this is um, awarded to the person who comes up with an idea to improve the process. Um, well, uh, this is, in my opinion, a really a nice idea, uh, this uh, batch, um, because many of the interest or newbies, new volunteers um, have awesome, interesting ideas and um, they, uh, and some of the ideas are really um, yeah, help, always helpful and improving uh, Fedora. And we are really great and grateful because uh, to be honest, uh, if you are in a system, you know, maybe uh, from work or from other uh, groups, not maybe Fedora, social groups or other sport groups. If you are long in this group, you uh, you, you may be uh, not really open for other ideas or you don't think left or right. And uh, so, Newbies are all, always an inspiration um, um, with, uh, if they have really nice ideas. So, um, um, yes. And the last batch was uh, onboarding specialist, yes. Um, awarded once a person completes process related to join sick. Yeah. Um, this would be, yeah. Uh, depending on his interests. Uh, like, um, let me say, if someone, uh is a good wants to translate or wants to is has coding skills and want to uh, improve uh, uh, rpm package or fix something a bug uh, etc um this will be uh, in his uh, specific interest um this badge can be awarded. But as I said at the beginning, these badges uh, are uh, created, but um, they are coming soon. So uh, stay up to date and be surprised. Uh, the next slide, please. Um, so how do you get started with contributing to us? Um, next <laughs> slide. Um, um, so the first first thing first is you have to create an uh, FAS account, a federal account system. And this is the important step. Um, well, I remember I can say this. Uh, yeah, we've recently talked, Alberto, that uh, you you are the one <laughs> uh, have welcomed me uh, and, uh, and guided me here to Fedora. And uh, this is really so. Uh, yeah. I guess we talked about two or three years ago, okay, three years maybe probably. Um, and uh, yeah, uh, and you see, <laughs> I'm uh, still here because of this uh, wonderful, awesome uh, community and team here. And uh, well, also thanks, yeah, now uh, as part of presenting Fedora Joinsic. Thank you, uh, Alberto and uh, Akadosh. <laughs> Um, yeah. Um, then, if you have created the your FAS account, uh, then uh, we are going to open up a welcome ticket. And with this welcome ticket, uh, which you will find on a Pagu, I have to. Sometimes I say Pagu in French, but it's Pagu. Um, uh, there you will uh, see uh, find you very uh, uh, very important steps um, uh, to go through. Um, so a lot of things to read, um, clear instructions, and. Um, uh, and one of the uh, important aspect is um, also I'm 
Well, I'm in the next slide uh, because I'm talking about it. Um, one of the important steps is um, you have uh, you introduce yourself. Uh, um, uh, we prefer, yeah, still on ma join mailing list um, um, because all can re read this um, for sure. You uh, and this will be added to uh, as well to the join Pegio group. But uh, we say uh, write an uh, introduction email uh, to the join mailing list because everybody uh, recognizes, sees, and can. Uh, right back and welcome you in, uh, personally. Then, um, yeah, uh, you are open um, actually to explore the uh, wide field of our uh, Fedora ecosystem and to explore the sub-projects and SIG teams uh, we have uh, to your interest. Um, so um, you can just uh, drop in in several groups. You can read the wikis. And um, uh, if you have an idea or you're unsure uh, where or whom to ask or where, how to join, therefore, we are also uh, uh, to help you. Um, to say, okay, um, here's uh, the link to the Telegram group or IRC channel or you know, the email or just ping person XY. Yeah, or for example, let me see, Anchor, for example, yeah, for Ask Fedora. Um, yeah, if you want to contribute, um, uh, and then um, you will, uh, we will help you out. Um, Yes, from time to time we check the progress. Um, I have keep in mind it's two, three weeks we check. Yeah? Two, uh, almost two or three, three weeks we check um, how's the status. Um, um, and we are asking, okay, um, are, are you feeling well? Are there any issues, problems? Or, uh, are you unsure? Um, for, or uh, isn't there something maybe it's normal that um, miscommunication yeah, or other problems um, um, and we, uh, we try to uh, there to help out and um, yes and yeah and if you have um, all the steps done and you're still uh, alive <laughs> And uh, yeah, and not a dead uh, <laughs> account. Uh, then we are we are all very happy to uh, have you as a new uh, prospective contributor in Fedora in our Fedora family as a valuable member. Uh, and uh, yeah, it's time to celebrate, and it's actually always time to celebrate if somebody joins Fedora Telegram group, and um, this is always for us. Awesome, and um, I, I'm always happy. I guess Alberto and uh, Akashdeep can uh, agree to this, and that we are all uh, happy uh, to open new welcome tickets, to help new users, and to see and uh, to listen to their ideas. And it's um, yeah, giving so much back. Uh, uh, for our volunteer work that we are doing all in. Well, in our free time, yeah. Um, so, um, and yeah, maybe one aspect uh, to add is um, you, you don't have to be afraid uh, voluntary work. <laughs> yeah, if it's free time. Uh, one of our principles is uh, as well, we say uh, first things first is always real life, your work your family, work-life balance, your friends. And um, it doesn't matter how uh, many hours you spend for Fedora. Uh, it's better to spend one or two hours in a month or in a week. Yeah, or no, in a week. Um, it depends on your capacity. And we all know, I can say, I have also times where I haven't much time or I have was was ill it's normal then i do less so uh and this is nothing to fear um because we are uh it's so normal and it's um 
and this is friendship friends friends friend friendship building um you can talk openly uh you know to the persons who do you like and uh no one nobody would say ah oh, no sorry um yeah so it's it's all always to say yeah quiet it's good uh thanks for saying this um and um, this is uh, also for me a part of uh, to be open awareness uh not to be ashamed if you are feeling i say weak yeah? um it's not it's not it's uh, uh yeah uh, join us join us we okay <laughs> <I'll burn>. <laughs> Some questions, <laughs> uh, little questions. Uh, uh, maybe we can answer from the Q&A session. We can do it in tests if you want asking some for us. And in the next uh, slide, we have no contact information. So if we don't have a lot of time to respond in this session, we can uh, join us in in Telegram um, on Element in ERC um, via Twitter or you can get uh, ask everything. So um, thank you, thank you very much, everyone here, in special uh, Akadesh, um, Andy. So, oh, we have a question. Uh, no, the, uh, they are questioning about the, uh, if the welcome tickets are created automatically. Uh, you can reach uh, in the join seek via the, um, I don't know, the telegram of element or ARC. Uh, we can, open this, this ticket for you. Uh, we can ask some questions about your interests and we can help you to engage your with the people who can help you in. You know, I do want to do some translations. We help with with that though. Looking the correct people in the in the project to that can help you, no? Um Many times, many times we can help you directly with, you know, you want to be part of the come up sick. Well, I'm in the come up sick. I can help you. So it's not automatically we need to present to you those in in the chat or via mail. So no, no are um, automatically. Put, you can put to FAS account here and we it will contact you for mail or or IRC is it, I don't know if this responds to your question Steven. And we don't seem to have any more questions and uh, thank you Alberto for the answers yeah, so uh we have a lot of answers to the poll and I'm surprised that uh, there are folks who have been a part of join SIG and they have been contributing to Fedora when they had their own welcome tickets. That's a great thing. Uh, it's a sign that our initiative has been helpful and we aim to make it more helpful in, in the coming times. So thank you very much for attending our talk. Uh, it was a pleasure to have you folks here. Thank you. Yes.